it has to be a calling. When you put on your uniform, you just never know what the day is going to bring. You see people when they are at their most vulnerable. And it's why you have to be called for us. What people tend to forget is that we, like you, can be vulnerable. And that we too are human. So who are we? And who is? I wanted to do more. I didn't want to sit around and do nothing. Find out about community medics and I was told that if I become a member I can do more for people when their call comes through. I started with community medics back in 2013. Uh, I was introduced to it by Cameron Horner who was a friend of mine at that time. I'm based here in Cape Town with him and still work for ER24 full time. Beach Road, not a problem, what's happening? Okay, we've got the MBA. Uh, how many vehicles? Community Medics is a non-profit organization who has volunteers that take out their free time, their own experience to help people when the, an emergency arises, whether it be from a car accident to somebody feeling ill for, for whatever reason may be. If the call comes out to our network, we have volunteers that will come out and comfort, treat patients, hand the patients over, make sure the patients get to relevant hospitals, and then still follow up to see with the family members of those patients on how the families are coping and handling what's happened. No problem, we'll be there shortly. Not everybody has somebody there to help them. I went through a part of my life where I needed help and somebody stepped in and helped me. So for the rest of my life, I'm going to be that person for someone else. Whether it's medical, whether it's to sit down and talk, um, I will be that person. That's why I do this. We've got approximately close to 100 volunteers. Uh, these volunteers range from medical practitioners who are registered with the HPCSA uh, to first aiders who respond to the communities as well as EFARs, which are emergency first aid responders. We provide this training free to the communities in which we operate and this training is done in partnership with the Department of Health in the Western Cape. Glenn is very passionate, I mean it doesn't matter no matter what call it is, whether we see it as a high priority call or a lower priority call, Glenn will always give that same level of care that he'll give to every patient. He, he's just got the passion in him. I mean it's not often that you find uh, employees who are dedicated to, you know, to respond to every call, give the same level of attention to detail and to make a patient feel loved and welcomed and that they receive the best possible care. To date, we, we've had a fantastic working relationship with, with ER24 and it just seems to keep continually growing from strength to strength. I've never regretted joining ER24. I love the company, love the people. Amazing company to work for. The best way to get involved is going to our website. You can email recruitment at communitymedics.org.za. It then goes to our team of volunteers in the management committee who handle all our HR process. They will then figure out which division you want to work in. Uh, they'll ensure that all your paperwork is up to date and then put you onto an induction process from there, which suits your skills and training and to get you involved into the Community Medics program. This Who Is episode is part of a new ER24 web series. To see more, subscribe to the ER24 EMS YouTube channel. Like ER24 EMS PTY Limited on Facebook or follow us on Twitter at ER24 EMS. You can also visit our blog. Just search for ER24.info.